Hello and welcome. Oh, it's muted. Let's try that again. Hello and welcome to a new series that I am uh, haven't named yet. But uh, what I got here is a level 2 monk. Uh, I just made the character. Uh, it's based on uh, a name my wife gave me for uh, Star Wars Ewok Adventures. Uh, apparently there was a character in that I never saw it, but a character in that called Tawani. And I thought that was a decent name for a uh, monk, since every other name I tried <laughs> was uh, rejected on my server. But here we are. Uh, we're going to start a solo self-found monk playthrough. And a solo self-found means we are 100% solo, uh, but we can... I'm trying to pull up the rule set I made up. There we go. There we go. Uh, so here we go. Uh, so we have to play solo, uh, but since we're on live, uh, we're going to go molo. So we'll have a mercenary with us. Uh, we cannot equip anything that we don't find. So we have to loot it ourselves. Our goal is to get to 120. Uh, yeah, mercs allowed. Um, I'm going to send all the trade skill stuff to uh, Nomergard because he is a trade skill master. Uh, my, my account that I made this character on is a gold account. And uh, I am going to enable auto grant because I am not going to farm up 30,000 AAs. <laughs> That's just not something I'm going to do to be able to kill a, a, a light blue at level 70. Uh, let's see here. Uh, I'm not allowed to buy anything from the bazaar. I think I'm going to do consumables uh, like spirit of wolf potions and stuff like that. That is something I would probably do. Uh, just depends on how uh, much money we get, uh, no grouping, and no power leveling. Uh, I was going to call the Drunken Monkey, and I'm not, I don't think I'm going to go with that right now, but that's that. So that's uh, kind of what we're doing. I got a few requests to do a monk, and uh, yeah, so this is a fresh character. Uh, doesn't have any hotkeys or anything set up, so I'm going to do some options real quick. Uh, we're going to turn the sound to 20 so we can actually hear anything. Uh, we're going to move the look sensitivity up to about 25. And on the X and the Y, I like to do uh, mouse looking in, my, in third person. That's how I like to play the game. Uh, see here, I don't think we need to do any hotkeys. Uh, see here, all. What is that? Control 1. That is from. Uh, Oh, that's just because the, uh, yeah, that makes sense. It's this client directory has that one set up for uh, IS Boxer. All right. Uh, da, 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 that looks good. Fast item destroy on. Click through mercenaries. Click through pets. And let's see here. That looks good. Looks good. All right. Go ahead and close that. And that, we can close that, that down here. And uh, let's just go ahead and get started. I'm gonna turn off uh, highlight messages here. And that should work. Uh, I don't think monks start with any weapons or anything, so we should be good there. So the first things first, we're gonna do the tutorial. I do the tutorial on all my characters. Uh, some people might not like the tutorial, but uh, I do it because it gets us a nice established uh, gear set, right? We should leave here with a full set of uh, blue armor. <laughs> All right, uh, let's hail him. Uh, I'm gonna. I'm not gonna read everything. I've done that and other other things. I'm just gonna plow, plow through this as fast as I can. I gave us arms. Go ahead and accept that. I'm gonna zoom in. Ail him. Did he give us the quest? Did he? All right, we gotta grab his sword, which is right there. Jump out here. Where'd he go? Perfect. Gave us a mask. All right. We need to hail. Let's do Flutterwing. 
siblings. There we go. We'll do that quest. Uh, Soulbinder. Say, bind my soul. Right. And then, uh, grouping and communication. Perfect. Perfect. And done. All right. The merchant guy, we're going to go to him. Accept the merchant for hire. He wants us to hire a merchant from him. So we're going to go and start with a... Uh, I feel like a tank is probably going to be the best one for right now. Let's put it on aggressive. And then we'll go over here. Let's hail this guy. Let's move that down here. We'll rearrange the UI at some point. Okay, what do we want us to do? Oh, hire a mercenary, talk back to him. Come on. Perfect. Kill one kobold infiltrator, they spawn right over here. So we don't need to look at our health bar. Uh, we'll probably switch to the healer one at some point. There's, uh, someone's already fighting that one. Hide models, none. There we go. Go ahead and kick it. Don't really have any combat abilities yet. Come on. There we go. It's done. Swim back over here. So hot bars, what do they want us to do? Talk to Alga. Oh, we, we didn't totally do that either. <laughs> Thought we'd finish that one. Alright, hail that. Can I make this bigger? There we go. Where'd she go? She's over here. There we go, we got the spirit of wolf mini uh, fun thing, so that'll help us move around a little bit faster during this early time. Oh, and I have my game sound up to my speakers. There we go, that makes sense. I thought I was wondering why I couldn't hear it. All right, uh, so who do we need to talk to here? Basic training. Hail somebody about trade skills. Let's go to Riltan. Go ahead and hail him. And say bless to him. He'll give us a buff. If the server's not lagged. There we go. He gave us a book, which is throw stone. So there we go. That's what shift S or shift A. Shift. Control C. I don't remember. It'll pop up here in a second. All right, that's done. Go to the banker, grab out the spare bag that we get in the bank. Hail him. Talk to him. Talk to the merchant. Let's see here. We need to do this achievement one right here. There we go. Gives us, shows us the achievement window. Go ahead and clicky click through all that. All right, now Varla. Where's, there, we got that. Varla's over here. Forgot to talk to her. Others. Armor class. All right, we can bring her burlap. I believe it's burlap, right? Bandages, some kind, yeah, gloomy deep silk. So we bring that to her. She'll give us more armor. All right, 
where is that gnome at for the trade skills? He's over here. So he wants us to make rat steaks. So rat steaks. Let's go ahead and I'll pop that right there. Go over here. So that'll go away. Turn that. Go here. Com combine. There we go. We got a rat steak. Oh, come on. Can I give that? Do I give that back to him? I can't remember. No. All right. Perfect. That'll give us a little bit of food and. Kenzie the Younger's in the mines. I need to talk to this guy. Okay, perfect. And all right, we're done with all of them. And Mackenzie's down here. In the mine. Let's go talk to him real quick. Do our little quick run speed. Jump over here. Go ahead and hail him. Did give us that weapon, right? We don't have that yet. All right. Augmentation. Lesson. Listening. All right. There. He gave us the aug. Uh, we can't do anything with the. Oh, he gave us the weapon. Never mind. <laughs> I was wondering about that. All right. I thought you had to talk to the other guy first. All right, so then we go here, drop the AUG in there. Makes it do six damage, it's not worth probably equipping, honestly. All right, let's hail him again. All right, basic training looks to be done. So we can go talk to Aris and uh, get the next step. Uh, is these two guys right here. Let's get basic training done. Which gives us a uh, charm. Which is uh, not bad. Extra stats, right? Everything is useful at this level. So here we go over here. Get this one. Accept that. Accept that. Right, we're gonna stop tracking that one. So we need to go kill four, eight, eight rats and four bats. There we go. So, so we can start establishing what loot is worth taking, what loot is not worth taking to uh, make a little money. So let's just do this. We'll sell it later. Open. All right, more rats here. We are five rats to go. Come on. There we go. Kick. Let's so move kick to two. We have mend. Should probably hit nine on cooldown just to level it up, but we'll see. All right, level three should go pretty fast once we uh, get out of here. Let's turn on auto grant. All right, we need to go to the spiders and get. Or cocoon silk. All right, no more bats or rats. We just need the cocoon silk. So I believe that drops from these cocoons. And that is the cocoon silk. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, we can ignore all these uh, spiders.
except the higher level ones over there. Oh, this one attacked us. Let's go ahead and kill it. There we go. That task is done. Let's go kill three more bats and destroy some nests. I think we can go up here and we should find a few more bats. Nope, no bats right now, but there is a pile of bones. Not what we wanted, but gives us some coins. Can we get these quests yet? Nope. Oh, there's Rufus. All right, we gotta get him. The only rare creature I think I've seen here. All right. And there we go. We got a Spirit Weaver Nexus, which is my mana preservation. Ah, uh, that's useless to us. All right, we got that one. And that one, one more of those. There's a bat right there. I think we need one more of these, right? There we go, that's done. Now we just need one bat. Might have to kill a few rats to, uh... Nope, oh, never mind. Here's one right there. All right, let's go ahead and uh, start moving some stuff around. I like this over here. Take the bat wings, we'll sell those. All right, oh, we need one more bat. Can I move this? All right, this is, this, this UI right here is annoying. You gotta like configure it that way and then go ahead and close everything in here. Uh, they're just like server server wide announcements that uh, don't really apply to us All right um, So we got another quest Two more quests So we need to give the cocoon silk to her, which should give us another item. Got a chest piece. There we go. All right, we need to go get a uh, an arrow out of the uh, what you call it. Uh, let's see here. Yeah, spider time. All right, let's uh, sell off all this junk we looted. These rat paws. Um, bone chips might be worth something. So we can do uh, barter and then bone chips and search that up. And we can see here that somebody's buying them. So we can go ahead and uh, sell those. Oh, those are fine bone chips. Never mind. Not the same thing. All right. But that is an easy way to make money <laughs> if, if you're low level and uh, you can find out something that somebody's buying. All right, let's hit over in, uh, we need barrels, I believe. There's a barrel right here. Just need an arrow. There's one arrow and a pouch and some food. Take all that. So if I go like this, I can hockey open. Put that on three for right now. So we need four lurkers, 12 spiders, and this guy. I'm assuming they're all going to go attack it. There's a bunch of people here right now, so I'm going to ignore them. Bandages. I usually throw them away, but uh, 
have a feeling it may be useful. All right, let's kind of, I like to have all my bags like sorted kind of like this. And I didn't buy any of the expansions yet, so I don't have any of that. So there's nothing to claim. Uh, when I get to, uh, I guess 115 I'll buy the, <laughs> I'll buy Luckland. I don't, I just don't see a point buying it before then. Actually, I'll probably have to buy, I don't know, I don't know how that works for the, uh, for the other expansions. Alright, we'll take the silk and the legs. I'm not sure if I can have, I have access to them without buying them. We'll definitely try to sell those uh, uh, defiant legs or boots. Let's see if uh, anybody's buying these yet. Tacky silk, spider legs. Sometimes you get lucky and somebody's buying. Some weird stuff. All right, let's go ahead and uh, use mend. I <laughs> failed. <laughs> All right, might be beneficial to actually probably have a healer at some point instead of the. Uh... Oh, there's another name I don't think I've ever seen. Interesting. There we go. Uh, I'm gonna set my mercenary as the main tank. Hopefully that means he'll taunt. There we go, he's doing his taunting job. Chunk of bronze. Nothing useful, all right. We need a few more of these. Did I get that arrow? I did get an arrow. All right, level four. Let's see here. Yeah, I think we're doing all right. I'm just trying to see what uh, what we're missing. Just some lurkers, and lurkers spawn up there. Can I put that in the offhand? Oh, it's got that AUG in there, yeah. That's a horrible, horrible weapon though. Lots of, lots of, lots of players. <laughs> when I logged on earlier, it was like 160 people in the new, uh, new players chat room. So that's kind of crazy. Kind of crazy indeed. All right, some rough silk. All right, one more of these and we're done with them. Let me go get that named uh, shaman over there on the other side. There we go, and we got some cold defiant cloth. No good for us, but all right, so he spawns right here. We'll just wait for him to respawn. Should be fairly quick. Come on. There we go. It's a frog. Come on, buddy. Spawn. 
never uh, seen him not up, so this is pretty uh, interesting. stuff is being uh, bought. Wow, not a single one. Okay, where is it? There he is. Spider Tamer. Guggen. Guggen. Kick him. Do we have any, uh, no, we don't have anything else, so we just close this window. Uh, I like my group down in the corner. My mercenary right next to it. I like my... Hold on. <laughs> can't get that, uh, I can't get the corner. I like this like right around here. Get a little bigger for right now. All right, we need four lurkers and speak with Valhalla and the slave. All right, we need to do that one too. So it looks like uh, there's a lurker. There we go. So I just need four of these. Where is, uh, I'm gonna move, actually open a uh, new bar, right? Yeah, these are all bound. Yeah, that's good. That's good. Uh, I don't need this bar right here. I'll just move it over there. Like that. And I want mend on say four? Feign death on five, maybe? I have all my other characters on five, so I think that'll work. There's a lurker. I need more lurkers. There's one. Go ahead and mend. Failed again. And then we'll eventually auto skill all the uh, combat stuff. Alright, so where's my target? Target's right here. I like it kind of like right around there. Like that. Let's bring this up just a little bit. Here's combat abilities. I was looking for that more than a minute ago. Uh, throw stone is the only one we have right now. So just go and throw it right there. Let's put that on three. There's another one. Uh, it uses our endurance. I don't know if it does any damage or not. One point, so. Not gonna break the game. Chunk of iron. I think we can upgrade that that uh, crappy weapon it gave us using that. Using the bronze and the iron to upgrade it to the next tier. But uh, it's not worth even using. Perfect. All right. Return, deliver, deliver, speak to. All right, we're done up here. So we can uh, head over here to the cave entrance. Our exit, I guess. And sure, over here, there's another Rufus. It's 
surprised there's not a uh, achievement for killing all the, the named in here. All right. So, stop right here. Close the bandolier. We need one arrow for this guy, right? There we go, completed his quest. Then he tell, tells us about a bow and arrow. Ah, uh, but we can't use a bow and arrow. Uh, we can also hail him, complete another quest. Uh, we need to give this violet to uh, this lady right here. There we go, level five. Go ahead and do that. I thought she had a quest. Yeah, the mushroom. So we go over here. Pick up the mushroom. I th don't think it's an actual. Uh, I don't think it's an actual quest. Quest, but there we go. That is done. So we need to speak with uh, clothing lady right over here. I guess I could have optionally talked to the guy over here, but we got pants. Uh, we can sell sell the rest of this junk. Uh, I'm gonna sell all the silk, quiver. Uh, that should be over here. Let's go ahead and sell rough silk. Spider eyes, spider legs. That should be good. And we can I'm gonna go ahead and destroy this and that. Swap that there, destroy that, destroy that. And that leaves us bone chips. I think bone chips will actually sell at some point. So we'll just hang on to those. All right, so we're done with those quests. I don't think these guys will give us anything else, right? Besides the queen quest. Yeah, and then the other guys are up with the other end. So we need to go kill the queen real quick. So let's move this like right there. I'll pixel perfect all these later. Yeah, I like them. Now, we should be able to kill the queen fairly easy, but, uh, you know, so we are level 5 now, so it should go really quickly. I think I've only had issues on one class going through the tutorial with the, uh, with the queen. I think it was a, uh, possibly a ranger. I'm trying to remember now. Alright, Queen is up and unengaged, so we can just walk right up here and kill her. So hopefully, uh, hopefully that tank will do his job. Mercenary tanks don't really take any damage until uh, things get really crazy on them. It's kind of funny. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, mend. Ooh, it worked that time. We wanna we wanna use mend on cooldown just to level it up. I believe it starts at like zero. Alright, we have ten, so. Definitely, and there's a treasure chest we can open. And we get spider venom. Which, uh... I don't think we can use that. <laughs> yeah, uh, 
Uh, it's rogue only, so... Hopefully we can sell it. Uh, let's head back up to uh, the top of the cave. I think we can use our spirit of wolf, uh, totem here. Get a slight bit of run speed. Rufus is still up. I'm surprised no one's killed him. Alright, who was that? Card art. It's not even the right. Oh, it's. Oh, okay. I see how that works. I never noticed it before. It sends us. It's like a little bread crumb. Bread crumb quest to go to the next guy. So that's kind of funny. Oh, there's Holbart. Hail him. Gave us some potions. Uh, throw those on my bar. Got a helmet. He didn't give us anything. Come on, give us something. There we go. Got those. What about this guy. Alright, so we gotta go kill grunts, warriors, and all that nonsense. Alright, there's more guys up this direction, so we'll go up there. Here, let's go, uh... I don't have the right maps on this stall. Yeah, they're right over there, so... Go up there and see if we can get their quest yet. So, Warrior's the first one. I think we need 10 of these anyway. Got Round Kick now. I guess we got that at level 5. I just wasn't paying attention. Uh, never gonna loot that. So we can get backpacks out of these sometimes. Sometimes. So it's kind of worth it to, uh, if you uh, have it hockey like this, right? You just click on them as you run by. Like we got a small bag. This grunt. It's like free, uh, free money. There we go. But yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm excited to see how far I can solo <laughs> this character. I know it's gonna become insanely hard once we get uh, to a certain point like past level 60 but I don't know I really don't know I do have a 96 uh, monk and I did a heroic on him and he's he's actually pretty beefy so I think we should be should be fine into the hundreds so we'll see I think the one of the hard parts is going to be getting uh, weapons and armor at like 115 and uh, 110 because all that stuff's no drop for the tier 1 COV and the tier 1 uh, Lachlan unless they change it cool parts we can sell those Uh, let's do that. There we go. And then when we get real bags, they'll, uh, work out. Alright, let's kill this guy. Woo, stunned us. Those are healing potions, so we can, if we need to heal, we can always use those. I don't plan on doing the hero's journey. I plan on just grinding as much as much as possible. Kind of using the same uh, 
Same as all my guide videos. Uh, we had a we had a thousand uh, subscribers on uh, YouTube, so so hopefully uh, I can try to get that on Twitch now. I'm gonna try try putting more effort into Twitch. I was working on my Holdridge character, my Paladin, that I'm doing this kind of the same thing with, but uh, I haven't. For some reason, I didn't. I didn't even think about streaming all the stuff in between <laughs> that of those videos, like the uh, the whole leveling process and everything. So yeah, it was a lot of missed opportunity. But he's not. He's not a challenge build, so it's kind of not as. It's kind of boring. On uh, there's no challenge to it, right? Because I, I literally took him to, uh, to Blovetian and let him loot, uh, loot everything, so he's, uh, he's doing well. Alright, let's go up here. I think there are two guys up here that should give us, should give us missions. Alright, we got two there. And two more there. All right, perfect. Oh, gave us a lantern. And we got another one of these. Swap that. Now, I know monks have a weight penalty. I just don't remember what it is. I'm sure we're at it right now, but I'm really unless it slows down our run speed, I don't really care. Because I'm not going to be tanking until uh, a little bit later on. Alright, so what do we got to do here? I need a lot of stuff here. Um, kill goblin slaves. Alright, so we need to kill the slave wardens and the slaves. Pretty much kill everybody. And without having snare, we might try to target the undead uh probably hit up um unrest uh, about 15 i think is a good good level for that and we'll uh i don't think we by default we only have one so we might have to buy a slot if we have uh i don't think we have any yeah i don't have any on here well i got 500 because <laughs> i just golded this account but no, we don't ever want these, never. But I wanted to be able to get the uh, loyalty tokens. I already got a few of them acquired from the uh, other character I had on this account. It's free to play, but uh, I want to get enough of those so I can buy the uh, teleport devices. So I can uh, teleport to uh, my guild hall for uh, easy transporting around. There we go. Let's go ahead and turn off helmet. I don't like the way that looks. Looks better. All things considered. There we go. Round kick. <laughs> I love that. All right. Get another slave. We need uh, six more slaves. And... A bunch of uh, kobolds, but I, I leave those because as as we're running back and forth through all this, because we have to go over here uh, for Glooming Deep to actually kill uh, the captain in there. So do just running back and forth, we're gonna kind of get some of those automatically. All right, let's get all these. Hopefully, we get a backpack or something. Ah, uh, we can sell all the arrows, so that's nice. Alright, there's two more over here. Alright, let's go down this way. Let's 
It's like nothing attacks. That's funny. Alright, let's see. There's a captain. Oh, captain attacked. Doesn't look like we have the quest for killing captains yet, so. Go ahead and just kill this one. We need to go down here and set off the bomb. Uh, about level 10, we can solo the uh, group mission for the cap, uh, the uh, whatever his name is down here. We're level 6 right now. Cobalt leather belt. Take it. Good. Nope. Oh, this guy wants to fight. Can we just walk over this thing right? Uh, lantern, right click. Oh no, we have to give it to it. Never mind. Alright, that's gonna blow here in a second. Jail, that can knock out two things, so let's do that. Uh, we'll do the jail to uh, try to level up a little bit. So we can kill the, uh, the named in there. And this will knock out Flutterwing and probably a lot more of these uh, kill kobold things. seen this guy before broken claw wow this is like <laughs> i guess because it's like right now is like a rare uh rare mob event uh for normal rare mobs so all these <laughs> names I've ever seen before in here are showing up there isn't like an achievement for that is there i mean it's like totally missable uh, i don't even know where gloomy deep would be secrets uh fedor Yeah, I don't know. Can't remember what expansion added this zone. Hey, how's it going, uh, MC Light? Alright. There we go. And Grim Iron Boots, which are never gonna be looted by me. Oh, we got friends. Never mind. <laughs> yeah, I'm giving a monk a try. Uh, doing a uh, challenge, challenge mode where it is uh, solo self found. I uh, can't group with anybody but my mercenary, and I can't loot or I can't wear anything that I don't loot myself from my solo kill. So definitely. Uh, Gonna be interesting. Come on. And the uh, the name is uh, something my wife came up with. Uh, Tolani. Uh, it's from uh, a uh, TV show, I guess, that came on when she was a kid, <laughs> like Ewok Adventures or something like that. Maybe a movie. Uh, there's a character in there named uh, Tawani or something. I, I didn't remember it, so. But, uh, yeah. I can't tell if I'm, like, hitting with my offhand or not. There we go. Level 7. Alright, we're gonna have food for days. Cause I can't 
can't loot that right now. Alright, let's go up here. Tons of arrows. Hey, Eben, how are you? Uh, let's see here. Oh, there's a sleigh. Let's kill him. Yeah, this is the right way. Alright. Oh, let's go in. I almost feel like a rogue... A rogue mercenary would probably be better. I think that would probably... Uh, best way. We might just swap it out. Oh, there's the locksmith. We need to get him. Uh, let's see if we can sneak past that guy. So we need to find a key. So we can just loot it, right? Someone's already killed him, so... That works. Let's kill him though. Actually, let's delete this one. And just loot it from this one. I think that feels more, uh, more in line. Alright. Let me go this way. I'm taking the slave warden. Okay. And mend worked. Yeah. <laughs> nice. All right. He, he actually taunted it off. All right. Let's uh, adjust that. down here not that we're gonna probably use that much let's, let's actually just go like right there bring that up to there oh we're getting smashed now all right i guess he is he's killing this one let's swap There we go. Now we loot our own key. And some more. Alright. I think we're gonna need to, uh... Bind wound. I don't know. Can we even use that? I think it has like a 50% HP cap, so I don't think we can actually use it. Now we got a hit, so... <laughs> Deliver the key, port back. All right, let's go get Flutterwing's uh, egg real quick. That'll be the most challenging part up here. smell the blood. Alright. I don't like that there. I think two. I can go. There. That works. Oh, okay. Monks can go to 70%. I'll try it here as soon as we uh, get to a spot where I'm like constantly being attacked. All right, let's uh, get another bow. I, 
can go sell for a plot, so that'll be nice. Oh, nice. It does work. We'll bandage you up. It only gives like 1% at this level. Oh, 0.4. All right, let's sit. And I think it'll, uh, yeah, at least like 3% per just sitting. That's broken. <laughs> yeah, it looks like it goes up to, uh, to 70%. 70 I think there's a, uh, AA ability. First aid, right? So take it up to 80% for the next one, so... Definitely, uh, probably, uh... A way to go. I don't think I'll... <laughs> I don't think I'll be bind wounding very much, though. I'll probably switch to the, uh, healer mercenary. And just, uh... Let them heal me. I don't think it'll be a big deal. We're gonna have to find... We're gonna have to find magic weapons pretty quickly. Unless we get, uh, get some fists. There, that's good, good enough. Alright, so this guy's a trap, because he spawns the two guys on him, uh, as soon as you, uh, you attack him. Oh, got one of them, so that's nice. I'm gonna... Oh gosh. Alright, I'm gonna try to let the tank actually tank it, but... There we go. I've had them, uh, the mercenary run if there's like three mobs. It might have been on a free to play account though. Without the, the better mercenary. Through here. He's not even taking damage, so this is a. It should work out as long as we don't pull aggro off him. All right, let's do uh, new tab, new tab. This is going to be my hits. This is all right, so let's rename this one Smashing. Getting smashed. And then this is going to be. being hit and me being missed and we're going to uh, detach turn off high leg because that's annoying and then attach that one so smashing right here we're gonna go to hit mode all Number only. How we're gonna loot that? What is this? All right, we'll loot that too. Why not? Let's 
go ahead and help the mercenary out. And we'll leave those on the corpse. I don't think I've ever gotten this staff before. So we take that down. So we can go here. Turn off highlight messages, hide the scroll bar. Aim the tab to a space to hide that. That keeps messing up every time I resize it. I'm just gonna set it right there. And then window, alpha, faded level. Uh, like zero or a ten. There we go. Uh, solo strat as I level up. Um, it's gonna be pretty much face tank, <laughs> but we're gonna have to like fight stuff weaker than us, right? Um, it's I don't know. It's gonna be it's gonna be challenging. To say the least, like with at least with the necromancer and stuff like that, I was able to kite things, uh, but it's gonna it's gonna be challenging, uh, especially once defiant gear uh, kind of like stops being useful. So that'll be that'll be I think that'll be challenging unto itself, right? Uh, if, if we can hit 75 and we can solo like a Gribble's quest, which I don't think we're going, going to be able to, then we can get that armor and that'll be easy. But I'm not... I'm not 100% sure that's going to work out. Let's move this one right here. I could have just got, I copied the layout from my other character, but uh, no, we don't want that junk. What the hell was that? I just saw like a leather dude like just appear. Tab, space bar, window, alpha faded, 10%, and then uh, lot seven. I think it's seven. Oh, geez, it changed all my my hot bars for some reason. All my hot bars are all jacked up now. Oh, did it like increase the whole UI's font? Chat font. Face is not what I want. Font four. Ah, uh, did I just totally screw up my UI? I'll deal with it later. All right, crude defiant chain tunic. That'll sell for like ten thousand platinum. Wow, it's like. Comic Sans. Uh, let's see here. I can go in these little bags, right? Chat font 8. Let's just leave it at that for now. I'm gonna have to figure out how to reset the the font because I, I I don't like that. I 
All right, let's try to get past these guys. Guess we got a spirit weaver. Do we need to kill these? We need one of these, so. Might as well kill this one. And we don't need the key anymore. percent and then it went down all right the staffs are worth money all right oh uh, let's see here report report kill 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 all right we need a warrior so there's three warriors here we need all these let's just go ahead and kill these What level are we? We are seven, almost eight. Let's do font four. Wow, that really jacked it up. No, I'm not doing hardcore. <laughs> There's too many, uh, too many mechanics that, uh, I don't know. I've had characters just like die from fall damage from like that high. I, I just, I'm not doing hardcore. <laughs> So we just need these two. That'll knock out the battle. Should be doing all right. Wow. Gonna fall back just a little bit. Stage complete. And this is the way out, I believe. There we go, level eight. gloves are these magic gloves they are magic gloves nice and we're done with all those all right let's go uh kill these slaves down here there we go oh 20 percent one hit nice Not liking our current health. It's not uh looking good. Uh chain bracer, I'll sell. Four more of these guys, and then we need the named one. Of the named one, wow, that changed everything the Comic Sans or whatever the hell this is. Jeez. Uh, 
There we go. That's how you fix it. Chat font back there, and then I'll just leave those over here. Um, that should fade out. All right, let's go kill this guy. He's over on that side. The named uh, goblin. Should be like right down here, right? <laughs> oh, of course. All right. Um, that's why I don't do hardcore. Well, while we're here, let's go ahead and turn this into him. And let's see here. We have a bunch of these little bags we can uh, kind of swap out. Where's the merchant? Let's sell all this stuff. Yeah, the bows sell for one platinum, so definitely uh, worth it. Uh, barter. I want to check the coarse silk. Binding powder. real quick all right those are not stacking the way I want that one goes over here There we go, perfect. Nine gold for the uh, poison that we looted. None of this trade skill stuff selling uh, very well. All right, that should be fine. And where's the banker? Throw this junk in here for now. Because we're going to have to set up a uh, bizarre, uh, bizarre character to sell that junk. Oh, I forgot to sell the arrows. <laughs> it's like 50 of them. What are they worth? Three copper each? So we got a gold for those. That's not bad. Let's get our buff back from him. And so we need to go kill those and speak to Hobar. So that works out. Go this way to Hobart. Go ahead and hail him. He gave us uh, shoes, which didn't auto equip for some reason. So let's hail him again. Nothing from him. So we get two more quests from this guy. So yeah, now we have the captain's quest. So let's go back over to Fort Glooming Deep. 
and uh, do that. Still need, uh, oh, yeah, we were gonna kill this guy. Let's do this real quick before I, I get distracted anymore. He's over on the other side since we fell, fell to our death. All right. Oh, all right, well, I guess we're gonna fight our way in. I don't remember these guys ever attacking me last time. <laughs> I remember, uh, I remember way back when, when coin had weight, yeah. That was so annoying, because you had to, like, destroy your copper all the time, or, yeah, copper, right? Yeah, destroy your copper constantly. There we go, wow, he died fairly quick. Uh, we need another one of these anyway, so let's just kill this one. I really don't think this is uh, worth even using, probably. Alright, let's see if we can get past the rat. Oh, there's another name. I think we already killed that one, though. Alright, here's uh, Rook Flynn. that quest then we need the four captains which should be on the way to the overlord we are level eight i don't know maybe we can do the pit fiend all right worthless pipe mining pig can stay there let's pop over there and try the fiend real quick i think if the uh Mercenary tanks that we should be fine. That way it'll save us time on uh, getting out of here. All right, let's go up here. these guys oh looks like he's dead there there's a dead, dead gnome there's another one dead and another one dead wow hide corpse pc So he should spawn in the back of there, so let's just wait for a second. I can move some things around. Yeah, that should work. Try to free up our uh, main bag slots with uh, bigger slots. seen him not up there he is all right he is a uh, level 12 all right i guess we still have aggro on him 70 72 percent aggro There we go. 
I think that should be fine. Hits pretty uh, hard, hit for 20. Looks like I'm hitting for 22, so it's like an even fight. <laughs> Every single one of my kicks is missing. Sorry. Whoa, 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 whoa. Come on. I have no way to uh, get rid of the aggro at the moment. So we're just going to joust in. Joust out. <laughs> I remember having to do this when the game first came out. Like jousting back and forth with mobs. Ooh! Hit for 36. And I failed to mend. I thought I was lower. Come on. Hits me for 36, but the uh, tank takes like no damage. There we go. Back off for a second. 89. See character. Where is it? Uh, agrometer. Oh, he got me. So I'm at ninety. Oh, ninety. Oh, back off, back off. Kicked him for one. Hit five of my my five damage is uh making him wanna kill me. Oh there we go. Quicksilver orb range item with ten percent haste. Oh yeah. I'll uh oh god, I forgot we're blind. <laughs> I forgot we're blind. But we got ten percent extra haste and we killed a level twelve at level eight. Alright, let's get back up here we got more important business to take care of over with uh, the overlord who's right over here and we need four captains along the way come on back back a single backpack yet. Alright, here is our first captain. Let's bring him right over here. Alright, uh, that's looking good. Got a haste item. A 
soon as we hit 20, we'll uh, go to POK and get uh, daily quests. So we can get a uh, better uh, back, shoulders, and cloak. Go. Now there's quite a few mobs inside of here. I think there's uh like two two on each side, and then three are two of them next to the boss. If I remember right. <laughs> there's like a sea of corpses. All right, we're gonna kill this guy because he's gonna heal through the wall. We're gonna have to, uh, what kind of heal, what is this, a 28 second heal? Oh, that's not bad. I've never used those before, I don't think. Alright, we got a staff, go ahead and loot that, that is, uh, worth like a few platinum. Go over here and kill this warrior. Someone, someone's healing him through the walls, so gotta make sure we kill all the... Is he up there? No, oh, there he is, right out there, so... Should be fine there, there's a warrior there... Just that one warrior. Okay, we got him solo. Can't wait till we get to feign death and all that. There's the other one. So wondering where he was. All right, so not very high on the aggro meter. We'll let the let the mercenary tank. He is getting. He was. He actually had his health down. All right, he's fighting the uh, warrior. So let's swap to the warrior. Awesome, because it's like it'll heal us for like almost most of our life, and then there's an AA ability somewhere in here that uh, makes it do more. All right, I'm gonna bind wound for a second. Does anything over at 51? Yeah, it's not even worth doing. It's 0.2 because it, uh, we had a regen tick. Now, uh, obviously, Ixar would be a better choice for a monk, but uh, uh, yeah, I just went with what my <laughs> I had my wife pick it, so she picked human and she named it so. 
but that's fine. Adds more to the challenge since we don't get the extra 17 armor or uh, 5 regen. Which will, uh, won't even matter <laughs> after level 60. Alright, he is going down just, uh, kind of really relying on that, uh, that mercenary. I'm going to switch to a healer mercenary. I think that'll be, uh, make it a little bit more exciting, so I don't have to pull off here like this. Don't get crazy there, man. There we go. Crude Defiant Leather Tunic. And... Gloom Steel Chain. That's junk. Alright, let's get out of here before we get respawn. There's another captain. Go ahead and grab him. I'm gonna let the mercenary fight him for a second while I look at this. More armor, more hit points. Not even worth it. Hopefully we get a uh, simple defiant uh, tunic real quick. I've, I've gotten I've always gotten really lucky on uh, drops so all right we just need two more captains and I think we're done with the zone we can go uh, head out to Crescent Reach there's another captain and then we'll get uh, 15 maybe 20 in Crescent Reach and then, uh, whatever the hot zone is, I don't know what they are right now, but, uh, we'll probably do that. Move that over just a little bit. And put that right there. And I gotta shift all this over. There no more captains. Warrior, Spirit Reaver, Warrior. God, enough of the bags already. Give me a backpack. I think there's captains around this little moat. Yeah, there's one. And stuns. too perfect and that was our last captain so let's go talk to uh, Kiachi and uh, tell him that we killed the goblin uh, <laughs> I think that's his quest so he is left or right go up this way
So if we're quick enough, we can usually run past things. There's like a, it's like a six second server tick. And if you can get it in between the ticks, you can avoid stuff sometimes. Sometimes. There we go. And Kiachi on Hail Him gave us a bracer and a potion of invisibility. I'm gonna play in Skyrim. <laughs> a potion of invisibility from uh uh the Alchemist. Alright, now let's go talk to Holbart. Right over here. And I think this should be the last thing we need to do here. Can't imagine there's anything else. All right, we got uh, a fist. <laughs> Hail that. All right, that's everything there. So we just need to hail him and tell him the overlord is dead. All right, perfect. So the gloomy deep fist. 418. I don't I don't I don't think so. And he's right over here. Go ahead and hail him. There we go. Welcome to level 10. Alright. So we're level 10 now. Before we leave, oh, our mercenary just got upgraded. Let's go ahead and sell this junk. And I think that's everything. All right. Where is the banker? I want to see something real quick. So our armor class is 80 at the moment. If I lower my weight. So gain five armor class. So nine armor class. Fifteen armor class, so losing fifteen armor class by <laughs> having all these bags. So uh, that'll be uh, something we're gonna have to work towards uh, fixing. Finding a lighter weight bag might have to do some. Might have to do some research on that. I know I can get Tinker bags for like five k, but those are kind of kind of trash, especially at this point in the game, right? And those are all messed up. Let's drop in there I don't know uh, what's this two-hander away three I don't know that looks cooler let's put it in the offhand and uh, mess around with it for a little bit So we're losing a little bit of armor class, being over 17 pounds. Uh, so that is something we're going to have to deal with. All right, we finished all the quests here. So we can go ahead and uh, exit out to, to Crescent Reach. Oh, did I? I still have it. Good. Uh, we have to turn in the note to the, uh, the guild trainers in uh, Crescent Reach to uh, finish that quest too. So we're almost, we're getting there, we're getting there. Only 110 more levels to go. 110. All 
All right, we're not doing Hero's Journey. I'm not gonna get her quest. So let's run, uh, actually, right there. Come on. I forgot how uh, <laughs> how blind uh, humans are at night. It's not as bad as it used to be uh, in the original game, but uh, it's pretty bad. All right, go uh, the monk guildmaster. I don't see their show. There it is. There we go. We get a uh, Fangs of the Apprentice tunic, which has has a graphic, I think. Yeah, it has a graphic. But uh, no use to us. All right. Uh, training. Anything we can get. So at level 20, we get Eagle Strike. It looks like we picked up Tiger Claw. So we got Round Kick, Tiger Claw. So we don't need to open anymore. Fiend Death is at 17. Oh, can we sort it by level? There we go, 17, uh, Fiend Death. Eagle Strike at 20, Research at 16, Repost at 20, Dragon Punch at 25, Double Attack 15. All right, pretty basic stuff. Do you have any tomes? Sword by level. Elbow Strike. Focused Will. All right, I'll buy some spells. So Elbow Strike does 5 damage. Focused Will heals us. Alright. 4 damage, more damage. Alright, uh, everything else looks good. And we can head into town. We're going to change our bind here at the... Uh, the bind person, uh, the soul binder, and then uh, from there, we'll make our way uh, towards the bear caves. I like to go there. Uh, it's a relatively easy location. Uh, should be fine. There we go. We're bound here until we get to plane of knowledge. We'll bind there. Uh, I didn't train out, carried out my mercenary. Is there a mercenary trader down here? I don't want to go look for one. Ah, we'll keep the warrior for now. He's dual wielding now, so he's probably better. Tweak that down just a little bit. All right. Um... So these are all, those are blue still, wow. What level are we, 10? So we can kill Pumas, right? There we go. Oh, Throw Stone and Elbow Strike are on the same timer. skill item yes it is i think those are worth like a platinum i think we'll find out ruin bear pelt stay away from the cuddly bear that's for the frost fell thing
There we go. I'm gonna go ahead and use mend just to fail it. I <laughs> tried to get a skill up, but it didn't. Alright, what is this? Composite field plate, that'll sell for uh, platinum. Martyr, I think these pelts should sell. There should be somebody buying those if they're leveling up trade skills, but it looks like there is not. Let's try this cuddly. It's yellow. Man, is it like bugged? There's not a single person buying anything. Yeah, fine bone chips, that's it. Alright, well, we'll wait on that. There's usually somebody buying that kind of stuff. Stem is for the quest. We're not going to do that. All right. Uh, let's see here. I think the alligators might be worth killing. Yeah, you gotta hit it like on cooldown. It's uh, it's pretty crazy. I remember uh, a long time ago, I had a monk, and it was took a long time to get get men going. But once it's going, it's great. I'll have to make some macros to like put all this stuff in one macro. Just because I'm spamming it all anyway. Ruin cat pelt. I like to go to this cave right here. If we can get up there. Come on. There we go. These cave bears right here. They spawn really fast and there's uh, a bunch of them. And uh, this little cave can withstand several people being in here at the same time. They're such a fast respawn. Unless you're being like power level, then that's a different, different story. There we go. Yeah, they're <laughs> they're good caves. Uh, I don't I don't ever go to these ones here. This is the cat cave and this is the shroom cave. I Usually by the time I get out of the tutorial, I'm like level 10 or level 11 depending on uh, what class And uh, this usually seems to be one of the better spots and there's higher level bears uh, Towards the back so it, you can pretty much just stay here. Where am I typing? Oh, over there. All right. Ah, oh, did I mess up the font again? 
want. There we go. Yeah, it's chat font to change the size and it's font to change the name of the font. Ooh, this one's red. Here, let's pull them back a little bit. Ouch. 36. I'm not hitting any of those attacks. All right. You're going to get replaced with a healer as soon as I uh, find a mercenary trainer. So I can actually play this the way I want to play it. Uh, we should probably uh, make a new window. No. New tab. Turn off that. Rename this to chat. And then filter. Say. Tells. Group. Wish there was an easier way to do this. Guild. No one uses auction anymore, they all use channel one. Shout. I'll put say back on this main one though. Cause that's, that's the one that has all the spam from uh, stuff. All right, system messages, chat channel. Chat channel. All. Oh, there we go. And we don't want that. Come on, warrior. Pull it off me. There you go. Got your taunt working. a lot better on this one and another failed mend but we got to 12 mend nice is that rough raw hide raw rough hide <laughs> all right another one and the first one's already respawned so that's how fast this cave uh cave is so if you're if you're turning through here pretty quick you can uh Make a cycle. Uh, it's like bear, 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 I think. I don't know. There's a lot of them. And then it goes all the way back to the back of here. And then over here is undead. But you can get to t like 12 or 12 or 15 from this pretty easy. Or almost 11. Another one down. Let's go back to the first one. There we go. Elbow strike. Looks like our endurance generates pretty quick at this level, so. Let's 
So those ones didn't respawn yet, so we can move down to this one. Low quality. Alright, we got a lot of <laughs> a lot of pelts on us now. Let's see if any of them are anybody's buying any of these here. Low quality, bear skin. One copper. That's a scam. Ruin bear pelt. Ruin cat pelt. Nope, nothing yet. Let's get this roamer up here. Yeah. So we'll just sell all that to a vendor, I guess. Unless, uh, unless the uh, barter picks up and we can actually sell some stuff. Uh, sometimes you can get good deals, uh, like It'll be high level buying uh, uh, like the, the newbie pelts for like 100 platinum each or something like that. Definitely a uh, good early way to make a little money. Alright, Cuddly Bear just repopped. Come on. What do we get here? Are those composite or defiant? Those are uh, the composite equivalent for chain. All right, I'm gonna fall back. I'm gonna let him uh, do his thing because I can't take any more of those. Search that up. Yeah, no one's buying high quality bear skins. That's interesting. That is so weird. Though I'm not getting the message down here saying no buyers, unless it's on a different the server might be lagged too. There we go. <laughs> but it's some guy trying to scam noobs. Alright, um... Yeah, the server's lag. That's why these aren't returning. one uh, same thing it's just the server so lagged I was having a lot of issues earlier sending uh, parcels between my characters trying to uh, move all my <laughs> trade skill stuff to one character there we go hand hands going up I doubt this weapon is uh any good gonna pull that, uh, mend, and I failed again. on this thing here five minutes let's try that out I've never used focus will 
says, uh, focus energy to heal your wounds. Aggressive action will break the concentration. Large stained tooth. Sounds like platinum. All right, we're just going to go like right here. Click that. I guess let's sit. I don't know what that does. I got, I got no, uh, no effect, but it is taking my, uh, it's draining my endurance. I don't see like an effect saying otherwise. I wish uh, OBS would do a uh, a thing where you could uh, cycle the recording instead of getting like four hour long uh, videos, you could get like 30 minute long to make them easier to uh, deal with later on. Interesting. This is like, it's, it's, it's draining. It's kind of regenerating me a little bit faster, but not really. That is so... <laughs> that's just very weak. Alright, let's get rid of uh, this mail icon. Alright, let's move that right there while we're waiting. Almost full life. That's good enough. First guy is already up. Hello, Fizzbin Gamer. How are you? Go. Tiger Claw. I'm doing all right. Have to uh, to go back to work tomorrow, uh, but I've enjoyed my time off. I must say, did you get any time off for the holidays? There we go. Perfect. Tiger Claw. Man, is the server... server lagging? Slightly. Prist... No! Oh, pristine Bear is the trade. Uh, that's the uh, quest item. I don't want that. Remove. And we'll go ahead and destroy that. That's for uh, if you do the hero's journey, there's a quest in this zone uh, that takes those. Oh, you took a week off between Christmas and New Year's. Nice. Very nice. Do you play, uh, do you play EverQuest? Man, I am missing like every single swing. Come on. 
hit this thing. Come on. Oh, nice. Guys, I did a, I did a YouTube series on doing that on a private server. Do you do that on live or uh, or on a private server or a PEQ? There we go. Oh, <laughs> awesome. Uh, thanks for watching. <laughs> See if we can get a get a screenshot. I find that I don't take enough screenshots, so my thumbnails for everything always end up being uh, rather lame. Oh yeah, that's the trick one. It's level twenty requirement that drops off level ten mobs. So if you put it in your stuff, you can't use it. Have a request. Uh, amend. Another failure. It takes six seconds for me to for me to know. <laughs> uh, a wizard hat. I'll take that. Right, let's go back to the first one. Oh, oh, <laughs> request. <laughs> uh, yeah, I try to, I try to, I have a lot of, uh, I got a lot of Gnome Regard stuff coming out, uh, that I, I've been working on for the last few, uh, few weeks. Uh, not as much multi-boxing stuff, mostly because, uh, the, w the way to multi-box on live is, uh, frowned upon. And I, I still haven't fixed my, uh, my private server. I'm, uh, extremely, I'm extremely, uh, I guess ADHD. I am shinies everywhere. Yeah, yeah, that's that's, that's kind of why I just play uh, like uh, like the one character kind of series for the most part now. But if I ever fix my uh, if I ever get around to fixing my multi box server and restoring my uh, database, I might I might try to do uh, the rest of uh, Bellos and then. Uh, Try Lucklin. I don't. I don't think I can get past the uh, some of the mechanics. Yeah, <laughs> it's it's so it's so much easier to play when you're on on your own server. Definitely, you don't have to worry about anything. Disabling Defiant. <laughs> if you if you use the Defiant stuff, it like totally breaks everything. Uh, progression wise. All right, level twelve. Nice. 
Very nice staying true to like a TLP. That's very nice. This one. All right, these are blue now. I found, I, found, I think, I think it was the mage pets too, or, uh, are a little strong for era. I think that's this is one of the other things, but changing like all the spells and stuff just became, uh, it's just a little tedious to change the database and then you had to update everything. And I don't know. I never even bothered. <laughs> and the, the, also the, uh, spell eras right because if you buy all your spells in pok you get pretty much everything and even level capping it right you, you're still gonna get like luckland spells and velos and it was just like getting a, that was a little bit of a nightmare for me trying to uh see if i would even bother with trying to decide on well i have angioism right but i got the group one too <laughs> <laughs> you know and it's just like then they just add you're just added, adding extra time to your stuff to group you know if you if you use ageism right you're gonna have to cast it you know let's say 54 times versus you know just grouping the group one so you know it's a lot of convenient stuff that i don't know i i i just i think in my series i just went ahead and went with it it's getting too tedious yeah self-imposed honor system all right wow we're starting to pick up the pace here I'm gonna I'm gonna try healing. Does it work better if I stand? Sitting is sitting like what broke it? I don't think so. Let's just sit. I think it gives us like two points of, <laughs> two points of health regen, I think. I think that's all that thing does. Which I mean it, and it, it, it on its own isn't that bad. I don't think we got any Defiant stuff, so I don't think we got any. There it is. Uh, yeah, I don't think we have any health regen on our gear yet. Yeah. There we go. And another failed mend. Got it to 15 though. That's not bad. Yeah, yeah. There's, there's a lot that's different on live than there is on uh, on uh, a TLP. But I, I logged on to uh, the mischief, and I don't know. It, <laughs> <laughs> the, it, I don't know. I felt like it was a little. The experience was a little slow, but uh, compared to live, so I don't. I don't know. I don't remember when I did Agnar, how fast uh, I leveled my first first few characters. But I I had staggered them when I made them. I did like two at a time. There we go. But I'm 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 strongly considering uh, doing the next TLP server if it's uh, if it's a decent rule set that isn't true box like duo uh, a shadow knight and a shaman or something. Uh, let's go ahead and lift that. Really. I don't 
don't want to try. I don't think. I don't know if they assist, but I don't want to deal with that. one of these healing potions. That should get us going. Come on. Attack him, mercenary. Oh, you played on Agnar? Oh, that's cool. Did you, uh, what, what era did you play? I played in Classic and... Kunark and quit right before Velos. All right. Oh, you quit before Luckland. Okay. Yeah, I was in a I was in a guild and they were like selling all the loot without telling anybody and it was all drama filled and nonsense and I was getting kind of sick of the uh, chrono for everything if, if you don't do all the TLPs you like chrono is like a <laughs> like a pain to get right uh, and so I was just uh, more effort than I was uh, I was looking to do I think I remember a, a, some some guild named something like that, but I could be wrong. I don't know if they existed in the beginning. Uh, I can't remember the name of the guild I was in. Whole thing imploded. I was able to get a few uh, few raid kills though. I almost finished my warriors epic, uh, but they. They wouldn't let me loot the, uh, the piece from Plane of Fear. It's really annoying. Okay, when the service started. What level is this one? This is 17, jeez. Alright, got another cave bear. Let's see if we can get mercenary to tag this one sooner. Oh. Yeah, I think a TLP would be, uh, would be fun if the rule set's right. I don't, I didn't really, I don't think the mischief rule set really have appealed to me that much. Makes it easier to get loot and stuff, but I don't know, something about it just didn't feel right. Oh, you played an enchanter. Nice. Enchanter is a fun class. Yeah, yeah, very fun and classic when uh, when getting groups was uh, you know was more of a thing. Like on on live, it's it's kind of difficult to get groups, but I haven't tried <laughs> that hard. Uh, but yeah, I remember 
Like, and you, you'd build you'd build up a reputation. That's something I liked about about how the classic worked, right? Like, if you were a bad enchanter, you know, people knew. Or if you were, you know, just it, you know, it just always worked out, right? If you were really good at something, it was easy to get groups and stuff like that. Definitely uh, the only part of the game I miss that I wish uh, still existed. There we go. Tattered silk sandals. These are defiant. Sell those. Your reaction time is very lacking there, mercenary. I don't even know how to San Santhian. <laughs> I played a uh, I played a cleric for a while and uh, like when you were when you were bad <laughs> it was like it was pretty known but if you were if you're doing good uh, it was made it easier to get groups and stuff like that I remember being able to get into like the uh, fungi group to get a fungi for one of my characters once really easy all right, level 13. Let's go, uh, let's get this cuddly bear. Let's mend. I am so disappointed in that mend. Yeah, <laughs> there's. I've I've had some some enchanters that were uh, really good, and some that were uh, just there for uh, quick groups. You know what I mean? Uh, and a good enchanter always changed changed the way the game played. Like you could really get things done if you had a good enchanter. I'm never gonna do those quests from this character. <laughs> All right, let's get this one. All right, so we're doing doing pretty well level wise. I think we'll stay in this cave till 15, and then move to the undead till 20, maybe. I don't know. Maybe that's. I think unrest would be a better better zone. I don't know if we can get the uh the level 20 daily task sooner than uh sooner than 20. I know you can get like some of the uh the next level up at like 16 no, not 16 but 25 26 to to get the 30. So I don't know. Yeah, 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 you're right. They can set the tempo of the group. I, I, I think I only grouped with one bard ever that was really good. Uh, most of the bards were terrible. Uh, but it was always enchanters that really, really changed the game. Intimidation. Do I dare? <laughs> uh, let's put it on one. There we go. Is it gonna actually fear him? 
We gotta level it up, because Intimidation is one of our uh, damage-increasing abilities via the Intimidation... Where is it? Yeah, right here. This... This, uh... Passive. So, this is the first one will make him run, but the second one like increases damage by 5%, and it just goes up, so it's like a damage-increasing... But for some reason, the first rank is, uh... Fear. <laughs> there we go. Now we're just riding this low hit point thing out. Use another potion. Just free up some bag space, I guess. Yeah, of course you turn on me as I use the healing potion. Very true. Uh, let's see here. How are we doing? We're 38%. Leveling is going pretty quick. Which is nice. I am going to have to plan out uh, <laughs> different things to go farm because we're going to have to stop and farm for things. Uh, if I'm hoping we're lucky and on uh, when's the next patch? Uh, Wednesday? No, uh, they don't have it on the calendar yet. Uh, I don't think it's gonna be the fifth. I think the twelfth is gonna be the next patch or the nineteenth, and then they will uh, hopefully fix the Ring of Scale uh, auto grant. Which will then let us auto grant up to one one ten, which will uh, really be awesome because that'll take care of, uh, I think like 30, 30, 35,000, 30,000 AAs by the time we get to that level. Uh, so that'll be really good. Uh, but leveling should go pretty quick. I'm gonna try to stream this as much as I can in between everything else. We're it's definitely challenge mode as a human monk. Yeah. <laughs> my uh my Shadow Knight almost has sixty thousand, if not more, I think at this point. It's pretty crazy. I'm uh almost max AA on my uh Shadow Knight and my Bard, I think. Maybe my Beast Lord also but it's 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 a lot it's a lot of work all right there we go that is going splendid scatter orange scatter cloud boots those are vendor fodder, and that is trash. Oh yeah, <laughs> I mean, so like solo, like the the max AA you can get per kill is five, right? Uh so going solo, like on my necromancer, where I solo sometimes. I can, I think the most I've gotten per is like four per kill during experience bonus uh, weekend and stuff like that. But grouping is definitely the, the best way to go. But it's not that bad solo. If, uh, you can solo things. Like necromancers, paladins, uh, shadow knights, enchanters. I think wizards can. I don't have much experience with them. Uh, druid. I know my druid can kill. I have a 120 druid and they can kill things that give experience. But uh, it just depends. So, and you're gonna get like one or two per kill, depending on uh, the situation. And then you're gonna want to use a lesson to uh, speed it up. 
Speaking of lesson, we should go ahead and do that. Just do it here. Let's put it right there. There we go. That should give us a little bit of a boost. So what's that going to give us? 62. 70. So 10% per. So 10 kills per level. Yeah, yeah, definitely. <laughs> uh, makes makes things so much easier to do uh, multi-boxing. And uh, your class makeup also can really speed things up too. Like if you have a, a rogue, a berserker, a beast lord, and then a tank plus a shaman you're just gonna like melt mobs uh, my uh, my rogue does so much <laughs> so much damage it is so insane like uh, oh, like 600 to 700 thousand just on normal mobs and then burns for almost two million. But uh, I, I'm trying to, I'm trying to gear up a berserker to uh, team up with my rogue, in my, uh, in my group to see how, uh, how that goes. Because the berserkers get a, uh, I think it's like a 25% damage bonus increase, and then you stack that with the rogue doing, you know, massive backstabs and stuff like that. And I think it'll do uh, pretty well. I'm, I'm not getting. I, I know a lot of people talk about how Zergers are like the high, you know, real high performance, but I, I'm not seeing that yet, but I'm not, I don't have mine geared enough to, uh, to make, uh, any real judgments yet. There we go. Level 14. Let's go ahead and do this one. I don't think that guy's going to join in. All right. You need to taunt. That's your job. Your whole job in life is to, to keep the mobs from hitting me. That's all you have to do. You're not doing that. Why are you not doing that? Yeah, <laughs> so many A's. It, the, the cool thing is like the pure melee classes don't have as many as like a hybrid or a caster. And uh, that's the... Uh, one of the great things about it here let's just tag you oh stunned go Yeah, the 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 type five augs. That's that's been quite a uh, quite a bit of effort. <laughs> I do the uh, I do the first two missions on uh, two groups. Well, for the last uh, last three weeks during my vacation, I've been doing them twice a day. I don't I don't like the uh, the later two missions as much, and Blood Falls is just like a pain to get to. Uh so. I only do Vex and Shay, and I do those uh, twice a day with just normal grinding in between. And uh, it's uh, it's quite a job. <laughs> Two hundred fifty thousand AAs. Yeah, that's. Uh, that's crazy. That's um, that's a lot of uh, glyphs of destruction. <laughs> or uh, scales, dragon scales. If he's a tank, I don't know. I don't know what class that guy is. There we go. 
go. Oh, I think Elbow Strike is quite the. Uh... Oh, he's a wizard. So yeah, the 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 damage one. He's probably he probably raids right. Has to pop that every uh, every mob raid mob anyway. faster now that we're a little bit higher only six minutes into this lesson too <laughs> that's crazy do you do you play on bristlebane that's what server i'm on right now oh nice Fellow Bristle Baner. <laughs> you bought some stuff for me. <laughs> yeah, I, I try to I try to keep the prices low, uh, but sometimes it's it's whatever whatever it gets set to. But I'm uh, going through it really quick. I like to move merchandise as fast as possible. There we go. Intimidate. Still haven't gotten that skill to work. I'm just trying to level the skill up <laughs> so I can, uh, when I get to, uh, what, what's the next rank? 70? I can actually use the, uh, the next rank here, which does the damage bonus. There we go, that's good. Playing a risky game here. Another failed mend. <laughs> so sad. Alright, so our next skill is, I think, 17 when we get Fain Death. And that's going to be a whole other pain to work up. Alright, a Vicious Cave Bear. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Get this one. Get this one. Get him. There you go. Good boy. Oh. I don't want to get hit. It's all you. 100% you, mercenary. Pop oh, another potion. Doesn't really do much. <laughs> But we're at like 500 hit points. I think it only heals 500 total, right? No, it doesn't even heal that. It heals like 60. All right. Come here. Over here. Over here. This guy. There we 
There we go. Can't wait until we get Fang Death. <laughs> Hopefully that'll eventually uh, let me uh, drop aggro onto this guy. Where are we at here? 15. Nice. And we got a bloodstone that can sell. All right, let's get this vicious. Let's uh, tag him. Son of a gun. Get him. Oh, <laughs> yeah, that's the, the thread. Uh, usually when I get like, uh, like around about there on the about 80% it starts to turn on me but I, I think my hit points are adding a little bit of low HP aggro into the mix yeah <laughs> yeah I need to uh, I need to spend some time and uh, sort it all out it's uh, everywhere Simple plate boots. I'll sell those. I uh, so what I did is I copied my uh, or I did a fresh install on this one actually. I I've got another video I'm working on for YouTube, and I needed a uh, a clean uh, a clean install for that one uh, for an IS Boxer video, and uh, I just used this this client for it for this character. Had gotten some comments about uh, how <laughs> my UR UI was already populated with all the hot buttons and stuff. So I was gonna do an updated video without any of that stuff. But uh, I was I was actually planning on streaming tomorrow night, but uh, my wife watches uh, some show. And it's on today now. It's usually on Tuesdays, but now it's on Mondays, so... I don't know. those I guess. Dusty Marrow. Got that. What I mean by base one with just the UI in order, no buttons. Oh, okay. Yeah, I see what you're saying. We should be able to get a few more levels for this. <laughs> oh, you can? I didn't know that. <laughs> I'll have to, uh, I'll mess with that. I'll copy the, the files over from uh, my other directory and I'll try that. I'm, I don't, I haven't made a new character in a long time. <laughs> I'll try that. <sighs> Another failed. Never gonna heal, man. Go. 
go. definitely uh try that uh pargok i this is just like a separate i i do uh you can only have like on the launcher right where you can auto log in you can only have like i think it's like six characters or so maybe seven and uh so um, i i literally did a new <laughs> new install for this one because i didn't have enough uh uh launcher auto login slots or uh for this character Yeah, for the iOS boxer to you know do the like login without a, uh, because you can't uh, you can't copy and paste into the login window. <laughs> so uh, I use the launcher to launch them all, and so I have to uh, I do a directory for each six characters or so, and uh, I usually just do a fresh install so I don't have all the the baggage of all the previous ones when I'm doing it. They're not using they're not using the launcher. They're probably using MacroQuest auto login. Uh, that's the only thing I could think of. That's the only thing I could find uh, besides because uh, uh, MacroQuest does let you auto login to your uh, account bypassing the launcher, but you you store all the credentials inside of it. So that's the only way that they're doing forty. 40 plus it's extremely tedious just to do six with the launcher because uh you have to wait like 10 seconds for <laughs> or all so but yeah I, have, I wish i wish there was a better better auto login system and my uh my passwords aren't typable so it's uh it's a bit much so that's level 16 <laughs> Yeah, like uh, if you, if you've seen my uh, my multi fifty four x multi boxing one, it's pr I when I do that, I have a batch file that auto logs in using Macro Quest, and I literally just walk away for like ten or fifteen minutes before they're all like loaded and up and grouped and buffed and all that stuff ready to go. It's pretty uh pretty crazy. But uh, using pure pure ice boxer, I use the launcher, and I, I I made a lot of edits to the to all the game the game settings in ice in the config file for ice uh, ice boxer, so that each launcher is its own entity inside of there. So I can launch like EverQuest one for like six, certain six characters, EverQuest two for certain six characters. And then they're all saved in the launcher, so I only have to just select them in the drop down. It's a little bit tedious, but it's the only option they provide at the moment. I 
I was trying to <laughs> like so the way the launcher works right is it saves a token like a cookie like a web web cookie almost uh, inside of your install directory and then you can send that token to the EQ client.exe uh, to get it to auto log in a character but I for some reason it wouldn't 100% work the way I was trying to get it to work but there's it's all undocumented so I couldn't figure out what the actual all the command line options were and then I kind of gave up but there is a way to take the token that it saves in the launcher and log into your account Come on, Mend. You failed again. That is... That is the trend. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> there we go. I'm going to set that on never. I'm never going to use that. Because by the time I hit level 20, it's useless. All right. So we're 16. Halfway to 17. We got eight minutes left on this lesson. Definitely, uh... Yeah, I'm the I'm, I'm really excited. Hopefully, they announce some a rule set for uh, the next TLP that is uh, that is uh, boxer friendly, and uh, I think I'll try it out. Maybe not doing a six, but doing a a few. I want to I want to start it like from you know from classic and uh do it you know all from scratch or I would, i'd probably try out Rizona. there we go We're wearing this place out. I think we're gonna, once the lesson wears off, we'll move up to the undead. Well, I mean, I, I just wanna, you know, do the whole thing, right? Start it, you know, whatever they have is classic and then work my way up uh, doing the multi-boxing thing. Isn't uh, Rizona like at uh, Omens or past that at this point? Oh, come on. Get, get to work. There we go. I guess I, I guess I see what you're saying. And yeah, I, I guess. Yeah. 
yeah the catch up right i don't i don't know maybe it's just i'd like to do it you know when it's fresh and there's you know a large influx of people for a fresh fresh server and stuff like that There is that that initial excitement that you know is is on a server before uh you know it kind of goes down but it'll be interesting to see what they <laughs> what they announce in march and see what they are go that one and we hit 17 we picked up fame death Grab him. Come on. There we go. All right. So where's my Bane Death right here? Grab that. Put that on five. All right. We're going to have to work that one. Yeah, I don't know if I can, uh, I'd pay for 40, uh, 40 accounts. That'd be kind of crazy. I have 18 right now, so I could do three groups. <laughs> Just be a pain to level them all up fresh. Yeah, that's that's something I I, I didn't because when I when I played on Agnar, right? I that was like my first experience back to EverQuest in like you know twenty years or something like that, and uh, I didn't know anything, <laughs> so I was like, oh, I don't know what to do. I like it was, I was just doing the same old basic stuff, and I didn't realize that I I could go farm picks because there was like instances I didn't even know those were a thing. So every time I went to a zone, everything would be camped, and I would—I I didn't know I could just go to a different pick, and uh, I could just like go to Soul B, right? I could have gone there and just took it free. <laughs> I mean, it's just like one of those things like that that I could have—I could have used to my, you know, to my advantage and rolled up, you know, three groups into the zone and spawned my own instance. Which I'm pretty much able to do on live right now, anyway. Uh, so it's pretty funny. Oh, I don't want to attack him. So, it, you know, I think a fresh, fresh TLP would be fun to uh, try out and see. And do, uh, I don't even know what would be a good good starting group for a TLP server. Yeah, it's hard it's hard to know what their their stance is on on boxing. Like I feel like everyone I see on live is multi boxing, right? Like I, I rarely see like solo people doing anything that aren't So it's it's would be interesting to know what their their mindset is. Come on, get back up.
Oh, Rizona's MQ friendly? I know they allowed a uh, um, IS Boxer by name. I didn't know uh, Mac Request was uh, was friendly there. Come on. Taunt it off me. Yeah, I'm too low. <laughs> Alright, we've lost less than anyway. So, we made it so 17, so that was what? How many levels? 16, 15, 14? That was a few levels. That's pretty awesome. I did not. I didn't. I didn't realize that. I. <laughs> that's. That's pretty cool. That would make getting things done pretty easy. Wizard leveling group. Are you saying paladins suck? <laughs> AoE leveling. Oh, I see what you're saying. Check out the undead next. <laughs> Paladin's pull, DA pull letter. All right, let's get out of this cave. We are 17 6, so we just need a little bit more. I think we can kill. I think we can kill the undead now. Uh, they are going to slow us, though, so that's going to be annoying. Uh, this is going to be a pain without a uh, pulling item. Sixty-seven. <laughs> Just trying to get to twenty, and then, uh, and then I'm gonna go get the daily quest. Zombie skin. We'll take that. It's been like it's been like almost non-stop killing. Except for the few seconds I sat. Like, what do you mean? A uh, real fresh start. Bard monk. <laughs> Power leveling series? I could do a power leveling series, but it would be, uh, it'd be pretty boring. I'd just, uh, I'd get them all to 90 and then, uh, 
group them with my Shadow Knight as he kills everything. rooted me son of a gun oh yeah yeah uh, <laughs> it, it, it's a lot slower uh than power leveling it's uh like the the whole what 80 it was at 85 at 115 right now it's 90 the, like you can go it's like an afternoon to go from 85 to 100 i think on my one of my characters just sitting in uh, Great Divide while I uh, killed everything with my uh, Shadow Knight. So it's definitely uh, definitely a different experience. Come on. Now I need to get a uh, I need to get a character that can group with 85. Come on. Putrid bones. Oh, really? I'm, I think these sell. I, I'm pretty sure they do. I'm rooted anyway, so... Two gold. <laughs> Two gold. Might as well sell everything else while we're waiting. Ah, uh, the thing. Nine gold. And we hit 18. So that's nice. Uh, let's get rid of these. 65 platinum. Uh, I think I need that for something. Yeah, I don't, I don't think they show the, the horrible value that you get for it. All right, let's uh, let's go up this way. There's these better zombies over here. I don't like these skeleton ogres. They uh, cast too much nonsense. All right, finally used all that nonsense. Let's just pull back right over here. And hopefully we don't get destroyed by all this nonsense over here. This is crazy. Oh, we already got an ad. Come on. All you mercenary. Yeah, self found. <laughs> so, you know, that lets us get defiant, right? Uh, but we're gonna, we're gonna definitely hit a uh, a gear level. We're gonna hit a ceiling at some point. Where that is, I don't know. I think it's going to be shortly thereafter uh, Defiant stops dropping or being useful. So around the uh, 75 to 85 range. All 
right, one down. What is this junk? I don't know. <laughs> yeah. That's hilarious. Uh, we'll take that. Hmm, interesting. Yeah, I don't. I, so I don't know if I'll like if, if I'm able to uh, solo like the Gribbles quest and get Mark's Valor, then I think I could uh, kind of go that way. But yeah, we're gonna get killed here in a second. All right, I guess he's just gonna do all the work. So if I can do Gribbles, I can get Marks of Valor, which will let me get up to uh, 100 gear in gear. But uh, I don't think I'll be able to kill any names in, uh, in uh, EOK or anything like that. Mercenaries is like doing all the work. Ah. Hold aggro on this guy. One down. Mercs, the Mercs are the only luxury I'm affording. Decaying hair, I don't think I've seen this before. This must be for the New Year's, uh... Yeah, that's what that's for. Alright, let's, uh, let's fall back for a second. Focused will. Oh, you can use it while sitting. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna change to a healer one as soon as I get to plan uh, plan of knowledge. I think that'll be a little bit more uh, on the level. Yeah, I, I think I, I had so much trouble when I was doing uh, Gribbles when I first came, you know, started doing the, the multi-boxing stuff. Now, I, I, I figured it all out, right? <laughs> I figured it all out. It's a huge learning curve to this game. It's like a, it's like a two-year learning curve now. But I still don't know, like, like if you look at the uh, all the expansions, right? I have no idea what happened between uh, Dark Depths of Dark Hollow and uh, the Burning Lands. <laughs> Come on, get him. There we go. Oh, I think I think getting the 120 was pretty easy because 
I'd been farming Zalandikar for like the last six months because that was the only one I could really do without a lot of effort, right? And uh, that really having ore on all my characters really makes it easier to get to the next tier, right? And that was like something I, I didn't have when I first came, you know, first came back because I didn't have that. Well, I'd already done the previous one and I had already been on the previous one with that. So it is what it is. All right, uh, let's see here. Let's get this one. So as long as I keep caught up on expansions, it'll be, uh, it'll be quite a, it'll be easy to go from expansion to expansion. They have, uh, they have a shaman pet, so I don't think they're low level. Yeah, their pet's red. Level 29. They're level 37. I'll go this way. Not sure why they're killing, uh, these new mobs, unless they're trying to do the uh, New Year's quest. Uh, let's see here. Oh, fell to the ground again. Alright, let's... Need to move that stand button. Ship binding powder. I'll try to barter that. All right, can we get just this guy? I just want the mummy. bar because they share the cool down. all right let's get this guy oh this guy's oh he's buff buffing the pet what did he do nice oh he's buffing me i don't know i don't know if that's gonna be within my uh my rule set here for now. There we go. One down. What, uh, what expansion is Rizona on? Omen's War? Okay. Maybe I'll, uh, maybe I'll take a look. I'm almost done with my, uh, my characters on live, so... <laughs> I'll be, uh, I'll be set for, uh, I'll be set for till the next expansion. <laughs> All I need is uh, silk to drop. I think that's what I was, my short point was. Let's 
What's their name? Alright, we got uh, Strength, Oxen, Dex, Protect, and Spirit of the Cat. So, that was pretty nice of them. I'm going to allow that as not power leveling since it's not a damage shield. Leather. Lots of leather. So like I hit mend and it'll uh, jump up and then jump down. So sometimes uh, it looks weird. Because uh, every time I fail mend, I, it goes like I, I healed myself and then when the server ticks back, it uh, lets me know that I I'm disappointed. All right, uh, never loot those. All right, this guy's got a mace, so maybe it's a uh, defiant weapon. Oh, son of a gun. They do hit pretty hard. They're hitting for 40 now. Uh, 36 was the max hit before. Just sit here. Let the mercenary do all the work since I'm rooted. We <laughs> tried to reroute. <laughs> Jeez. Some crazy <laughs> bind wound. So, at my current skill level, bind wound does less than uh, half a percent of my health. There we go. So that's a fine steel morning star and junk. Ugh, where'd this guy come from? Yeah, I think it reset <laughs> the respawn here is real quick. I don't think I can hit it. Can you hit it undead with a... I guess you can. I don't think that's better than my... Uh, my fist, though. But I'm going to take it for the platinum. Another one. There we go. All right. I think we can inch out one more level here. So then we can go get the, the, uh, the daily quest. This is like running all the way to unrest and then uh, being disappointed. Let's just work on our one hand plot for a few. Alright, let's kill this rabbit. Alright, 18%. 
Oh, thanks for the follow. Sorry, Todd. I didn't see that. I have all that stuff turned off. I don't... I don't like the, uh... I don't know. I don't like it when stuff shows up on the screen. <laughs> uh, I don't like those guys. So if you make a 40 box a SK cleric and join you. <laughs> uh, maybe if we do a do a TLP server, we can do something like that. I try not to I try not to get too worked up I I know my my like my son watches like some youtubers and stuff like that that are really crazy and uh, I I don't I I try to go the opposite <laughs> I just don't I don't know be yelling at the the screen and stuff <laughs> six months Which 10 do you run right now? Shadow Knight, Shaman, Druid, Monk, Ranger, Enchanter. Okay. Oh god. Come on. Oh, he rooted me. Can I... Can I hit you? I can't hit you because of the tree. So how do you play the druid? I the, like, I have a druid at 120, and no matter what I do, the druid is like out of mana constantly. Like all the spells just seem to cost way too much, and there's no way to get mana back. Is that like, am I just doing something wrong? And I use the druid as like a, a DPS, not as a healer. Okay, quick heal on the shaman and then and then uh, CH on the druid. Bring 
Ranger, SK, Enchanter, Shaman, Mage, Cleric. Okay. Oh, God. Ah, uh, low HP aggro. Low HP aggro. Somehow I'm outrunning them. Come on, mercenary. Save me. Alright, one's down. Taunt him. Come on, jeez. Ah, uh, ah, uh, stop running. Just gonna have to face death. Because we're too low anyway. Yeah, I, f I figured as much once he got into the low under 20%, I was gonna not. Uh, not be able to get it off me. So I noticed both of you guys are running rangers. How do you uh how do you like that? I'm I'm working on a ranger in the uh level 60 range right now with uh with my paladin. And it seems uh pretty crazy <laughs> the amount of damage they do with a bow. Group Guardians is OP. All right, almost there. We got 65%. 120 has an alliance spell, okay. Hmm, okay, you pull with him and use the, the tank, or er, the Shadow Knight to tank afterwards, okay. Nice. Really? He's gonna come all the way down here? Ah, so we gotta deal with him. Fulfill a lion spell, it's one million damage, jeez. Don't you need uh three rangers to do the alliance stuff? Cause it's like three necros and three wizards and two three mages and stuff like that to to trigger those, right? Ah, <laughs> uh, come on. No, one spell, then 12 spells. Do they all need to be rangers that do the spells or any 12 spells?
Interesting. Oh, okay. Um, <laughs> I misunderstood. Ah, uh, got mobs up there. Let's get a little bit more health. This guy now. Yeah, I was pretty sure it was like 12, you know, like whatever that class is, right? Uh, but I, I always thought you had to have three of the same class to trigger it in a timely manner, I guess. So I've never looked into it. Since I don't, I don't box three of any of the same thing. I can grab this guy. Oh, he slowed me. Seems too close for comfort over here. And we got a zombie friend. Ah, oh, we got another zombie friend. Jeez. I guess I can just climb the wall here. Well, that's interesting. All right, let's kill the zombie down here, dude. He's uh in our spot. Strike idle. Yeah. Oh man. All right, we got another one. Go, go get him. Preemptively grab him, or he hits me. There you go. It's gonna be uh it'll be interesting when we switch to a cleric. Yeah, I could imagine a uh, ranger doing quite a bit of damage. It's like every everywhere I read is like Use a Zerker, use a Zerker. I was, I was hoping they would nerf Zerkers. <laughs> Cause I just don't, I don't enjoy the class that much. Oh, the tank Merc will carry me to 70. Oh. Interesting. That's good to know. And that's junk. All right. So we hit 20. Uh, let's let's get out of here. Uh, class special. Throw in heroes. That's good to know. They're uh, not rangers. Not more than a zerker, but they're good at uh, group stuff. That's good. Pretty interesting. It's, it's 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 not really twenty feet. It's it's you have to run all the way through the zone, and then you have to go to Blightfire Moors, and then you have to run through Blightfire Moors. 
it's a plane of knowledge. I mean, it's it's not it's not twenty feet away because they nerfed it. I don't know why it still says Crescent Reach. It says Save Life Fire Moors. Come on, come on. A thousand people on the server and they're all right here. All right, let's go here. Uh, level 20. Pauldral Caverns. That's like, that's like free money right there. Let's, uh, let's go sell. Yeah, I need packs. Uh, let's see here. Let's barter real quick. Let's see if we can make some of that sweet, sweet platinum. Chips. No. Simple composite. Sell that. Seven platinum for that. No, this account, I literally, uh, it was free to play for a few months. I don't have any bags. I don't have anything to claim, actually. I was debating buying the, the luck one one to get the bag for that, but I'm not sure yet. It's worth the effort. All right. Anybody buying that crap? Uh, refresh. Uh, I don't think you can with platinum. Oh, well, I guess you can buy the tradable one, but the tradable one doesn't give the uh, bag, I don't believe. Skeletal parts. I think you have to buy the premium one to get the one bag. I can't remember. Uh, I bought the normal one on almost all my accounts except for uh, like Gnome Regard. <sighs> Didn't really need the bag space. All right, so all this crap. I'm just gonna sell it all. It's taking too long. I can, not like I can buy anything anyway, right? Maybe consumables and ports and spells. Is the is the House of Thule one still available? Oh, it is. It's forty bucks. Uh, I think it's this one. You have to buy the sixty nine. Doesn't tell you anything, but I think you have to buy that one. Yeah, I'm, 
leveling is, you know, should be pretty quick, and uh, I think I can go kill the uh, Kunark dragons and get bags there pretty easy. Yeah, and there's there's some trade skill ones too. All right, that's everything there. Destroy this trash. And... Get rid of this thing. All right. Off to Podgeable Caverns we go. So that is... That's Nexus. Where are we at? So that's this way. Yeah, yeah, you, I, I can sell the fine on my server for, uh, for, um, <laughs> more than a hundred platinum. I got, I just got to set up a, uh, a uh, merchant for this character's account. And then I can just parcel all that crap back. The low, the low level stuff seems to sell for a lot. I don't know what, like, like I just throw everything up, you know, to sell, and I, I always undercut whoever else is selling, and the prices are pretty insane, right? Like ten thousand platinum for, uh, you know, those legs from the Ark Magus in, uh, in uh, Lower Guck. Someone bought those for uh, ten thousand. No idea why. There's gotta be some something to it. Puzzle caverns. Puzzle caverns. Shadow Haven. Shadow Haven is right across. Yeah, I couldn't remember. It's been so long. Yeah, if you got a uh, 105, you can uh, <laughs> we can, we can group. With, I got a character or two to group with if you want. way is it all the way to the other side of the zone <laughs> yeah the uh the, <laughs> the animations are hilarious uh, that's for sure And uh, when they move over to the 64-bit client, they they invest a little bit more into the game, and hopefully, maybe they do another some kind of update. Because if you look at some of like the new models that they have for like some of the new monsters and stuff like that, the blood bag and all the stuff, like they're really high-quality textures and stuff like that. So I think that'd be pretty uh, pretty cool if they uh, kind of update some some of the character models and stuff. Like there's a Yeti in uh, one of the Frostville quests. It's like got a really high high quality model. I was actually impressed. All right, what do we gotta kill here? We gotta kill bandits or uh, bandits. All right. So I think these are the bandits right here. So is it really that easy? No. Oh. All right. Well. Guess we're gonna have to fight them all right here. 
That's all you, mercenary. All you. exception for a fun guy i mean i could then i could make an exception i got this uh i got this level one usable uh high ratio two-handed staff too i mean i think i think it's fine once we get the uh second tier of defiant it doesn't even matter at that point Because the, uh, I think it's not simple, but the one after that, whatever that is, uh, has almost as much regen, I think, as the, uh, Fungi Tunic. Plus it has actual usable stats. There's uh there's one that drops in Sleeper's Tomb. Oh, uh, there's a uh, fungi tunic there. I can't remember what it's called. In place of the uh, uh, Shroud of Longevity, I had that drop when I ran through it with uh, one of my characters. I can't remember if it's usable by a uh, beast lord or not. I ran through it at like 115 and I don't think I looted anything except for a uh, primal primal mace or something. This guy's almost dead. This will complete the quest, I think. No, he didn't count. What is this shit? I'm gonna loot it for the one AC and two agility. Cause that's that's stats I need right there. There we go. Completed that one. Ah, uh, simple defiant. Where's the belt? The belt is 14% haste, 2 HP regen. We already have 10% haste. Uh, is this? No other stats. The belt it is. Good. Take that. There we go. And jump, 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 jump. All right, get out of here. And yeah, we're gonna have to run out of here. Actually, I'm just gonna go ahead. I'm I gotta get to <laughs> I gotta get to sleep for work tomorrow. Uh, so yeah, I'm enjoy chatting with everyone tonight. Uh, it was great. Uh, hopefully I'll I'll be able to do another one of these soon. I don't have an exact thing time uh, when I'll do it. But uh, definitely continue this character stream only, uh, just so it's a little bit more exciting. Uh, 
Yeah, there's a Discord server. Uh, it's linked off my all my YouTube channel of videos. So if it's not linked on my Twitch, then definitely uh, that's that's yeah. I I don't have any bots set up right now. I got rid of Streamlabs, uh, whatever. Uh, so I'll I'll, I'll I'll have to fix that. Let me see if I can get a link to it real quick. And uh, post that. Come on. So many little things. How do I? White people. Right, I guess it hides everything. I'll just paste it in chat. Uh, there you go. That's the Discord channel. There you go. But uh, yeah, so I uh, should have another one. I'm going to try it for this new year, get everything uh, streaming lined up correctly and uh, get that going. I got to update all my channel stuff, uh, all the thumbnails and all the all the end screens and stuff like that. So I have a on, you know, a consistent stream time and all that stuff. But uh, yeah, so thank you guys very much for watching and uh, see you next time.